That's great. Uh, so, James, as Neil said, you play Neil's future son-in-law. Yes. Relationships aren't brilliant on, you know, in the drama, but in real life, you lot quite like each other, apparently. <laughs> we had such a right. brilliant time. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely loved it. We had such a laugh. Trying to do serious drama with these two is like really hard work, you know. <laughs> everything's funny, everything's a joke. I can't imagine. Well, I'm so serious all the time. <laughs> Listen, I was, we, we, we were looking for a treasure. We found a national treasure, hey, obviously. Yeah. There you go. Um, yeah, it was, it, we, we were lucky, I think. We were lucky because we had to film it quickly yeah. and it was hard work. But yeah. when you get a good bunch together, it's sort of... Yeah, four hours in six weeks is like... That's like absolutely amazing work. And our director, Phil John, as well, I've worked with before. He did Good Karma Hospital and Dan Sefton both wrote it. So I was used to the kind of team. And sometimes we do there, we we do a rehearsal for a take and then do a take. And he'd go, right, moving on. And he'd go, what? What? Only one take? Yeah, I wasn't used to that. I don't have the confidence to... I, I like a good few goes. <laughs> I feel like I've done something right. Um, yeah, just one take, and you'd be like, right, I've got one needed. I'm there on. you go, that's all you need. Yeah. Uh, Faye, you play Neil's wife in the show. Um, yes. But, you know, I'm sure you're all going to be hoping that a lot of people are tuning in tomorrow to watch the, the show when it, when, oh, yeah. when it goes on. But uh, apparently, there's somebody you're hoping is not going to be tuning in. Uh, what, not going to watch it? Yes. Yeah. Oh, God, yes. I've, I, I'm not going to allow my husband to watch this show. He's got his eye on a metal detector. There you go. <laughs> every Christmas, I get the, I get the wish list, yeah. and it, there's only one thing on it. And every year, I, I just push it away. I go, no, wow. no, because we have a lovely marriage. <laughs> and I want that to continue. I don't want you to go into a field. Uh, this sounds no. like but my wife But at least you could have course. stolen one from the drama, <laughs> one of the props. Then you save yourself a load of money next Christmas. Yes, I could do that because yeah. they don't actually work. Oh, so I could. right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But we were, we were worried. James and I were a bit worried because there we are doing metal detecting and me pretending to be a bit of an expert and everything. And but, but you know, um, I did a bit of research to find out how it kind of works and everything. But. We don't know if the metal detecting mafia are going to chase us down after tomorrow night and say, that's not how you hold it. Yeah. Or you, uh, why would you buy that uh, machine? You know, so you wouldn't find yeah. gold in that. It's a hobby that a lot of pe people are passionate about. Yeah. yeah. So we're looking forward to the letters. Yeah. You're amateurs, <laughs> anyway, aren't you? You're amateurs. What we did wrong. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Uh, well, Finders Keepers starts tomorrow at 9pm on Channel 5 and My 5. Uh,